Hello there, say Dr. Soccer View on the Creatology F20 car, as it's called. Okay, um, yeah, uh, it's very nice. It's probably about a 30 to 30 minute build. Um, uh, it took me about two and a half hours to paint Ill's car because of all the bottom rubbish and. Just getting, there's a million pieces on this thing for the size. Probably has twice the pieces of anything I've ever built. Other than that temple, but I don't think I'll be painting that anytime soon. Um, yeah. Uh, let's get started with the uh, details with this. Um, we got two lights here on the bottom and two lights on the top. Um... We got, the wheels are very weird, here, have it focus on the wheels. There were originally marks there, but I tried to color, color them over, and here, I'll just take a wheel off for you. Uh, no, I won't. Uh, you can see it on here. Um, there's two parts of the wheel, the one I didn't know, I should have colored the other part black around here. But the other part is a black rim that you um, have to glue on. So that's how that's staying on. It's not a choice. You have to glue it on. If you want to. It doesn't look like. It doesn't look good at all. With uh, with just the uh, wheel. Without the rim. Hold on. Focus. Okay. Um, my attempt at orange flames at the sides. This side turned out bad because I didn't know part of the car piece there would overlap. So, and that part turned out longer and I didn't try that. But this side turned out shorter and that looks okay, I guess. I was going to decal the sides of flames, but I decided that would kind of look weird. Um, the inside, the interior, all the interior is gray. The steering wheel is black. You can see that in there. And the bottom is also gray where the seats are. Um, the back, there's a lot of bumpers. I was going to call where those four holes you see there, like the, uh, the brake lights. I was going to color those in red, but that I decided not to because they're open and kind of just be around the rim. So, I didn't do that. Um... One thing that was really weird is these sides to, to attach. Probably took me about two minutes each when I was already painted. Because the paint always makes it hard to build it back together. Um, that's about it with the F20 car. Um, I'm going to show you what I'm going to paint next. The new train, that is $6. I already had a train. I'm actually going to bring out here to compare it that is my old train and this is my new train the old train is bigger but looks weirder I'd say my cat ate that part so I gotta fresh that up He's always eats my stuff um that's a little messed up the only thing I didn't like about this one is these little um gets edges that you have to put in the front they're very hard to put in the front and weird um but it is m much more detailed much more awesome i guess than the old one and it looks more realistic so that will be a nice paint you see in the area here that is closed and the old one that is more open the bottom of this one is much more clothes, much more detail. So that will be interesting how it plays out. I'll probably paint it the, the exact same color type. Because red and black look good on trains. Well, I guess that's it. This is a review on the F20 car by Createology. I'll have another paint and review soon. Expect more Lego stuff soon also. And goodbye.